William Mellon here for GetMoreSports.com, talking about a prospect of the 2016 class who has made waves uh, with his recent play in the Nike EYBL circuit, and that, of course, is Harry Giles, uh, the number two rated player in the class of 2016, according to Rivals.com and just about every other re recruiting service as well. Coming out of North Carolina, plays with CP3 Elite, one of the better traveling clubs in the Nike circuit, and he blew up this past weekend in Houston. Now, blowing up is a relative term. And I want to start with that because Giles has always been considered one of the best players in his class. Yet, a lot of people seem to forget about him with the knee injuries that he has suffered. ACLs, uh, the braces that he's had to wear on his knee really hampered his athletic ability, his comfort level. He never looked like he quite settled in, but that is off now. And he exploded a big time way in Houston, reminding people just how gifted he is at 6'10 with a 7'5 reach. I mean, he has tremendous length. Really great coordination in terms of ball skills. Obviously, an athletic ability is there as well. He can hurt you from all different spots on the court. And I read a tweet over the weekend that said, one of the most impressive things about Giles was he has the ability to step out and knock down threes, which he did. But the very next time, he goes down the court and parks on the block, gets the ball in the post, and scores. He's not going to just hang around the perimeter and try to be a finesse player. He understands his gifts uh, on both ends, and he utilizes them. It is great to see him back in the fold. It's great to see him back on the floor playing and showing why he is in the conversation with Josh Jackson uh, for the number one player in the 2016 class.